Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 7 of the Photoshop tutorial series. So today we're going to talk about layer opacity. So layer opacity is how you control the transparency of each layer. So let me just uh, as usual create a new shape out of the uh, selection tool that I have. So I'm just going to press control backspace and I'm going to press uh, control uh, alt backspace. So I have two layers right there. So right now you can see that my uh, object right here is totally opaque. That meaning that I cannot see through uh, the top layer. So if I were to relocate the layers, then I cannot actually see through. But if I were to increase the opacity, then it actually become the file actually becomes transparent, the layer actually becomes transparent, and I'm able to see through. And to control that, simply go over here on the layers panel. Over here, you can see opacity. So if I were to drag this down, you can see that my a layer one is becoming more transparent. So you can see that I can actually see my blue layer beneath it. So if I were to completely drag it down, then it actually becomes 100% transparent, which does not uh, have much use. But if I were to drag this up, you can see that I can change the level of opacity right there. So my layer two is actually opaque right now, and layer one has um, uh, opacity of 59%. So layer two as well, I can just drag this down and you can see that both of them now has opacity and the center part, the overlapped part actually is see-through and you can design interesting elements out of this. So that is how opacity actually works inside of Photoshop. So uh, this is something that is very useful for designing and if you want to gain the opacity back up, you can simply just move the slider and the full information is back. So this is used for various types of designings. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.